Hi everyone, this is my chemistry channel. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about the metalloenzyme such as catalyst. In previous video, we have discussed about superoxide dismutase. And this superoxide dismutase enzyme is again redox metalloenzyme, which is used to convert the free radicals, that is uh, free radicals from oxygen, which is peroxide and superoxide into a molecular oxygen. During some electron transfer reaction and cell metabolism reaction, there are some free radicals are generated. Those free radicals are very highly toxic to the cells, which damage the cells. So those cells are converted in, sorry, those free radicals are converted by using enzyme called superoxide dismutase. So the superoxide dismutase plays a very important role in the conversion of peroxide to a molecular oxygen. So during those reactions, it generates a byproduct called hydrogen peroxide. So the superoxide dismutase during the conversion of oxygen radical to a molecular oxygen which generation of hydrogen peroxide. And this hydrogen peroxide is again very toxic to the cell which leads to the cell damage which completely collapse the DNA structure. Okay, So this hydrogen peroxide is overcome by that is decomposed by another enzyme called catalyst. And this catalyst makes this hydrogen peroxide to a water and molecular oxygen. Okay, Let's see about the catalyst. So this catalyst is again an example for redox metalloenzyme because it taking part in the reduction and oxidation of in reduction and oxidation in the reaction so it becomes called redox metalloenzyme and it is a eme containing it's a eme containing protein eme containing protein and it acts as a antioxidant act as an antioxidant and this catalyst is a very crucial enzyme to decompose the hydrogen peroxide to a hydrogen water molecule and molecular oxygen. So it is well known enzyme to reduce the concentration of hydrogen peroxide. And this eme containing protein reduces the so decomposes the hydrogen peroxide to a molecular oxygen and water molecule in, in millions of times. Okay. Within 10 per centimeter per second, it decreases the thousands of hydrogen peroxide, millions of hydrogen peroxide to a water molecule and molecular oxygen. Okay. And it is very stable and rich st structure. So this catalyst enzyme has a very stable having a rich structure and it resistant towards the pH okay more resistant towards the pH and if you see the structure it is a eme containing protein iron eme containing protein and if you see the structure the iron is coordinated with four nitrogen atom of four pyrene ligand and above and below there is a ligand okay it will be having histidine and arginine groups okay so this is about the structure of catalyst and this catalyst has two types of sorry there are two steps involved in the mechanism and if you see the mechanism simply the reaction of catalyst so this in 3 containing enzyme IN3 containing enzyme which is in the ice spin state. So iron in the ice spin state which reacts with hydrogen peroxide. This is the first step. Hydrogen peroxide. It forms plus water. Pi radical of 
or pyrene dication. Dication. Okay. And the second step, this Fe4 enzyme. It is treated by hydrogen peroxide which converts the Fe4 to Fe3 which regenerates the enzyme and gives water and molecular. So this is a simple reaction of this catalase and if you see the mechanism. This ion porphyrin enzyme taking hydrogen peroxide which gives After taking hydrogen peroxide it forms like this which is in the plus 3 state I spin state. Okay. So during this time it transfers this histidine residue transfer this proton and making this oxygen become polar. Okay. So this transfer of hydrogen takes place by the histidine residue present to this enzyme which makes which is in the ion in the plus 4 state the generation of water in the second step it was reductant hydrogen peroxide which is act as a reductant that is a reducing agent used to reduce this which regenerate the catalyst enzyme the generation of water and molecular so here again this ion get reduced. So in the first step the ion gets oxidized from plus 3 to plus 4 by taking hydrogen peroxide. Okay. And it is a pi radical of porphyrin cation. And it again reduced by the hydrogen peroxide which converts ion 4 to 2 ion 3. So this is the native enzyme. And decomposed of hydrogen peroxide to a water and oxygen takes place. So this is about the reaction and mechanism of catalyst enzyme. In next video, we are going to discuss about the another enzyme called peroxidase. Okay, we will meet in the next video. Thanks for watching.